practice is known for being innovative and we tend to be the first practice to bring uh, various technologies into the mainstream. Affiliated Urologist has been around since 1968. We have three locations throughout the valley, Central Phoenix, Biltmore, and Desert Ridge. We currently have five physicians and two mid-level providers. The prime site system, it really came at a very good time. There was a lot of concern about cleaning scopes and delivering a better product to our patients. When you had a scope with a lot of moving parts, it was difficult to adequately clean all of those little mechanisms to the level we expected, and especially to do it in an office setting where we had so many patients to see. This is the sterile sheath that it comes with. Every time you have a new patient, you just open it up, load it onto the scope, and it's ready to go. Once you're done with the patient, you just unload it by just removing it from the scope. You wipe the scope down with the endo wipe. It's an enzymatic wipe. You just wipe it down and then clean it with alcohol after you flush it. Technically speaking, the scope never really touches the patient. And that technology for our patients was a revolutionary one. A lot of the harsh chemicals and disinfectants used for traditional scopes are contraindicated in patients that have bladder cancer. So by using the prime site cystoscope and endosheath, we're able to eliminate that risk and not have to worry about them having an anaphylactic reaction while in our office. It really allows a rapid turnover system and it allows you to also work with other providers in the office who may also need to use the scope. With prime sites, the cystoscope and the sheath, the turnover time is usually as quick as five minutes. The mere concept of having to wait 20 minutes or 15 minutes is a nightmare. Regardless of the number of patients I have, I only need one scope. Because everything is disposable, the scope itself is going to be intact and never have to worry about any of that damage. Number one, uh, I feel like I'm providing them with less of a risk of an infection. There's less moving parts, there's less chance of a bacterial transfer, and that's the most important thing I can think of as a reason. It's the welfare of my patients. When we do add more providers, we don't need to purchase additional scopes right off the bat. What I'm seeing throughout the day is easily paid off as what would be you'd be concerned for the sheath. I saw X number of patients and I got X number of procedures done, which couldn't have been done if I was using the traditional scopes. But having done this for years now, I can easily tell you I'm definitely in the green rather than the red.